All right, I just did the primaire, but don't want to miss out on the acoustic. This was my last year's exposure to them, and spent, we spent uh, some time after the show, one of the best times I've had with this channel uh, doing this series. So you guys check it out if you didn't watch my tour of their thing, but this is not easy to make, <laughs> as I saw firsthand. Um, the, costly, but look at the conductors you get, the construction quality, quality control. I have never found a better um, cable company, period. And they even do recordings, too. But Sven's going to show us some other cool stuff. What, what you got new? And the, I mean, last year, from the splitter to the splitter, it was the same. And now we upgraded, as you know, the, the, the last Oh, part you keep it, yes. So that's why we separated it. So here, now it's also the You've got the spacers. Clips. Exactly. So you have basically air now from connector to connector. That's the that's cool. And especially in the interconnect cables, it's a quite big effect when uh, when you uh, listen to it. Uh, also with speaker cables, um, you hear a difference. And it also, if you see it here, maybe it, it's a little bit shorter. So because it's more flexible, yes. we can we can use the big air part uh, now a little bit longer and and shorten the smaller part. So it's it's actually it's more air, uh, air electric at the. And let me tell you guys something. Uh, this is a company that does believe in measurements. We saw the lab. We saw some great experiments that they did. Definitely want to check that out. But if you do change the geometry of just that last little lead to your speakers, if it's spaced differently, that makes a difference. So being able to now do their spacing all the way up to the connector is a huge advantage. And you saw the quality of the connectors, how they affix them. Um, and then at Exponent, you saw the new cable. Yeah. Now this is for... <laughs> big budgets, but again, the pedigree behind it. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, we have uh, oh, this, yeah. this year. We have like, like also the the hand samples, like the pra partially assembled um, products yeah. <clears throat> for better understanding how it works. Uh -huh. uh, like this is a power and uh, phono cable, and very new. We do have. The Air USB cable, which has been released in North America already for, for a year, okay. exclusively by our partner there. And now we're introducing a copper version and a pure silver version okay. as well. That's, that's cool. Yeah. All right, let's see that mega. Uh, yeah. From the manufacturer, area. maybe you remember him. He's always smiling. Yeah. Apparently, he likes us. <laughs> yeah. It's not like the sales manager. He's a good actor. But he yes, like you're, you're a good actor. Uh, yes. Maybe you remember this from uh, from your, uh, uh, from Exponent. Yeah. This is a better chance to get really close to it. Yeah. You know, the amount of silver alone in here is it's amazing. Four, four times the the 24.5 and uh, with a huge uh, splitter that we also built ourselves and uh, if you remember we have this laser engraving. The laser engraving, we, so we, we saw that done. We put the serial number in it, the, the description on it. Mm -hmm. And, and here, they make their own jacketing too. Exactly, we have their own jacketing and this is not the size of the 12.5, this is actually similar like the 24.5 so it's, it's, it's also much more air dielectric here. We use the new clips. This the red ones we only have so that the, the screws won't fall out during the transport. And the reason why we do this is uh, there's always a lot of pressure, especially when the yep. cable is heavy. So you connect it, put it in the right angle, release the pressure, and then you fix oh, the screw. Okay. And uh, you have a better connectivity because otherwise, if there's pressure, there's no full connectivity inside the, yes. the connector. And let me tell you guys, you can waste all you spend on this part if this connection is not solid or half pulled out. You're sabotaging a lot of what you bought. So this little detail here, innovative, to me, this is again why I put in acoustic at the top of my list. That's despite, very innovative. Despite the people that are working Expect, there. Yeah. Well, Sven, we can excuse you. <laughs> And then you've got even a ground cable. Yes, we have a grounding that you can put into the grounding box as an option, or you can put uh, if the grounding is in the electronic. The speaker, like a tannoy if, or an audio vector speaker. And, and if there's no grounding, you can just uh, take it off. It's, yes. It's just an option. No, that's awesome. And also, we have those B wire jumpers in the air range, um, like uh, the 
1205 uh, uh, pure silver copper version. No, this is amazing stuff. Yeah. And another new thing, we we can also similar like the XLR that you can move 45 degrees. We have the same with the USB air cable. Another yes. that you can. Uh, Paying attention to that connection and release the quality. pressure. Yeah, yeah. and especially our partner in North America, he loves the the air USB cables um, mm -hmm. in pure silver. He sold a lot of them, and uh, but we gave him exclusivity for the first 12 months, and now we're releasing it a copper version and a pure silver version also in the rest of the world. Awesome. Yeah. Well, thanks so much for showing us that. Thanks for coming. I wish I could come visit you guys again, but I'll do it <laughs> at some point. You got to come visit me next. <laughs> yeah. Then we, we can go some, uh, some concerts. All right. All right. That's a deal. All right. Good seeing you, Sven. Cheers.